Lamborghini Aventador Expert Review Bob Hernandez The 2022 Aventador is expected to be the final model year of Lamborghini's flagship exotic. The V12-powered supercar debuted for 2011 as the Aventador LP704 and is offered for 2022 in two models, with either as a closed roof coupe or open-top roadster. Its chief competition comes from other exotics like the Ferrari 812 Superfast and McLaren 720S. What we think? Chevron. We are going to miss the Aventador when Lamborghini decides to finally retire its long-running flagship. From the exotic's extreme exterior edges and scissor doors to the mid-engine V12 mounted behind its carbon fiber monocoque, it is every bit a supercar as anything the brand has ever produced. And it drives like one, too. Muscling around a 2019 Aventador LP770-4 Superveloc Hota, a name that was eventually shortened to SVJ, its high-speed stability was fantastic, in no small part due to its fancy, instantaneous active aerodynamics. It was also one of the quickest cars in the quarter mile we've ever tested. The car's not without its shortcomings, like brakes that can get sketchy and a transmission that could stand a retune. But overall, the Aventador is a great road car and one of our favorites. And with projects like the Ferrari San Hybrid Hypercar testing the waters of future mid-engine V12 applications, it looks like the legacy of the Aventador is in good hands. 2022 Aventador Powertrain Chevron the Aventador has the distinction of being the last Lamborghini to come from the factory equipped with a non-hybrid naturally aspirated V12. It's a doozy, 2A 6.5-liter engine that develops up to 770 horsepower at 531 pounds foot of torque in the Ultimate model. Power is routed through a paddle-shifted 7-speed automatic to a 4-wheel drive system. Estimated city fuel economy is rated in single digits, 9 sixteenths of a mile per gallon city slash highway regardless of SVJ or LP 780 to 4 Ultimi, Coupe or Roadster. How fast is the Aventador? Chevron. It's been a couple years, but we ran a 2019 Aventador SVJ through its paces when it was new, and it did not disappoint. The sprint to 60 miles per hour from a standstill took a scant 2.5 seconds, and to a quarter mile the run was done in 10.3 seconds at 136.4 miles per hour. The Lambo's quarter mile time is in the same league as supercars like the McLaren 720S and Bugatti Veyron. Aventador Ultimi, Ultimate Performance The LP780-4 Ultimi is the Aventador's final edition and features the latest versions of performance technology that Lamborghini has developed on the model since day one. Standard four-wheel steering is designed to improve turn-in and cornering. Active aerodynamics are to improve front and rear end downforce and grip. The car's 4WD system is calibrated to send more torque to the rear for sportier oversteer behavior. All these systems are run by the Aventador's active vehicle dynamics computer, which processes information on the fly to deliver the best performance. It's a perfectly imperfect send-off.